Hello everyone, this is Jason from UIKit iOS and in this video I'm gonna make a customized channel list according to versa request. When there are users who is currently typing, the channel cell shows a typing indicator on the bottom of the channel name. When you send a message like this, the channel cell shows an image view that represents delivery with a received state on the right side of the channel name. Alright, let's start it. So, here's an app look like this. From the main view, you can change the user. When you tap the connect to send bird button, action named did tap connect will be called. Let's show the list of group channel by calling group channel list view controller of SB view controller set inside of the action. Now you can see the channel list after tapping the button. Let's customize the channel list according to the Versa request. Versa wanted to use a typing indicator and delivery with received features that were originally supported within the channel and the channel list as well. Let's create a file called Versa Channel Cell. Import UI Kit and remove Foundation and import Samber SDK. However, after beta version release, please use Samber UI Kit instead of using Samber SDK. Let's create class called Versa Channel Cell inherited from SB Group Channel Cell. There is there are configure method set up view set up layouts set up styles there are the interfaces of sandbird lifecycle let's declare some view properties cover image view is to show channel cover image title label is to show the chain channel name message label is to show the typing indicator as well as the last message the last State image view is to show delivery with received state. Next, also add some properties which help me organize the views layout with SV step views. Let's set up views. Content step views set up horizontal step view with cover image view and label step view. Label step view set up vertical step view with title step view and message label. The title step view set up horizontal step view with title label and state image view. Let's set up layouts. Set up layouts of content step view, cover image view, title step view, title label, state image view, and message label. Let's set up styles. The SVVS channel cell has a property called theme. You can get font and color from the theme. From the configure method, you can update channel cover image and channel title, message label, and state view. Let's create a function called update message label, which checks if there are any users that are currently typing. If there are users that are currently typing, Use the channel header typing value from SVU string set to update the message labels text. Then create a function called update state image view.
using the last message that the current user sent in the channel. Use SBU utils get received state method to get the received state value. Use this value to get an appropriate icon from the SBU icon set. Before we apply it to state image view, please set the correct color and resize the icon to fit the state image view. Now we create a custom module component in order to use the customized channel cell inside, a, inside the list component. Create a new list class of versus channel list module that inherits from SV group channel list modules list. After that, override set of views and cause the register function to use versus channel self before setting view elements. Lastly, let's go back to the did tab connect action that shows the ch list of channels. Update SVU module set to use a customized list component before showing the view controller. After the update, Cinebra UI key uses it as a default of the list component of the channel list module. Now, let's run the app. When there are users who is currently typing, the channel cell shows a typing indicator on the bottom of the channel name. When you send a message like this, hi there, the channel cell shows an image view that represents the library with received state on the right side of the channel name. Thank you.